Hi guys, welcome to another session. So today's session, I'm going to tell you about how to s automate web services with Unirest. Unirest is another web services test automation tool which we can use in multiple languages. In an earlier video, I covered about how we can use it in Node.js. In today's session, I'm going to show you how we can do it with Java. So let's look at how we can automate web services with Unirest in Java language. First of all, let's glance through the Unirest Java implementation. So this website, Unirest.io, java.html, gives you all the information that is needed to start a Java Maven project. So you have the dependencies and you can do without Maven, you can download the Java files and integrate them, but my high advice is to use with Maven. And how you can write scripts, it's all given in this site. So what I have done here is I have created, I have got uh, open up Maven, I have opened up Eclipse and I have added a Maven project. Simply you can add a Maven project by, uh, by installing the Eclipse Maven integration and also after installing it Maven project Maven option is available so you can click the, Mav the Maven project option then click on sim create a simple project and give the group ID and artifact ID that you prefer after that what you have to do is you have to it will or it will create a Maven project and uh, it will show in the Explorer the project Explorer of Eclipse and you have to go to POM file and add the dependencies which are specified in the site. So you can say, see, Unirest Java has been added, HTTP client, HTTP sync client, HTTP MIME, J, uh, JSON, cli JSON uh, dependencies, all these dependencies, even JUnit has been added. So what I have done is I have created, although we, I have added JUnit, I have created a test ng project. I created a package, then Java class. Then what I have done is I go to the implementation I have imported the libraries so I have imported asset and this should be test ng test ng assets So what I've done is, I have brought test ng assets and uh, test ng annotations and the Unirest necessary libraries. Then what I have done is, I have created a response object, which is a JSON node, and I am I am doing a simple get call for the demo QA sites with the API. So it will return. I have put a header to accept JSON and it will return a JSON response where I am checking whether the response is success and I am just printing the JSON response body so let's see how we can run this test case so it gets executed and it goes without any failures you can see it asserts and also prints the response body so this is how you do web services automation with Unirest and Java. If you like this post, please put a like in the LinkedIn. Thank you and have a nice day.